Uh, how the fuck do you say this? How do you say this? Do you introduce yourself as in, Hi, my name is Vicky. No, my name is Virginia. They call me Vicky. Welcome to my channel. <laughs> I already did my eyebrows because I take a little while. So, um, this would be just like a get ready with me. Not like a full detailed tutorial, okay? Just so I can get the hang of this. Um, right, I'm gonna start with my primer. And I've been using the Wet n Wild Rose Primer, the water drop primer, and I mix it with the Touch and Soul uh, No Pour No Pour Blend. I'm gonna put just a little shit, just a little bit. I apply this one like on the. I have dry skin, like dry to normal skin, especially during this time of year. And I usually get my dry skin like around the T zone. I hate it because I start peeling all over my nose and. It's just disgusting. So now I get the uh, touch and soles, no pore problem, no pore blam. And then I just put them on my T-zone because this one helps with, well it helps me with all the dryness and the flakiness. So I just press it onto my skin. So I'm using the Flower Beauty sponge. The Milani Conceal Perfect in Creamy Vanilla and the Light Illusion in Shit. Oh, it's in Warm Beige. Put it on the back of my hand and then I just tap it on. There's not a lot of stuff going on in my life for me to go live. Or do, not live, but do vlogs about it. I just pretty much sit at home. Go to the gym, you know, same thing. It's the same thing over and over again. Probably doesn't even match my skin, but... But since the Milani does oxidize a little bit, then I'm, I'm okay with that one. So I just go around my brows. Because I already went over this one here. And I just... You see, I, I applied one pump of each, and then I put it on the back of my hand, and I just keep going to see where I need more. And then we're we got to draw shit. Now I know why people actually drop it. Like all YouTubers, obviously they're always dropping something, dude. And I'm like, why? Why do you drop shit like that, Vicky? So I just keep on. I'm probably gonna cut this shit because this is way too long. But you gotta make sure to blend it well. You know, you gotta make sure everything blends nice. It blends into your skin so you don't have, you know, marks anywhere. And it adheres into the primer and blah blah blah. Dude, I suck at this. I don't even know why you people want tutorials. Because if you want to have a cakey ass face with green eyeshadow and glitter everywhere, then this is your spot. <laughs> this is the Light Illusion Concealer from Flower Beauty in Light Medium. I use a tiny bit for my dark circles. Um, this brush, I don't remember where I got it. I think I got it off eBay like a long time ago. And I'm just going to place it right on top of... Should I take you guys in closer? No. Too many flaws. Please stay there. So I just pretty much dab it and place it where I need it on top of the dark circles. So if I bring it down, it's just going to make it, you know, way too dark. The Marc Jacobs Remarkable Concealer in Too Alive. And I'm going to grab the Flower Beauty. I think this is a concealer brush. So just applying it a little bit and then I'm just dragging it down. And this is going to help with highlight. There, and then I grab the blender, the one that doesn't have the foundation. And I just... Blend that out. There we go. Now, um, I had a request to do a contour, like a very, very detailed contour. So that's why I'm doing my face. I don't know how I'm going to explain it, but we're going to go for it. So I have the Stila Shape and Shape Contour Duo, and this is in light. 
follow the contours of my face. And I'm, I'm not gonna drag it past my eye because then it's gonna look like you have a beard. We're gonna keep it there. Just grab a little bit and drag this thing back. Let me see if I can do this. I can do it, I can do it. Dude, this is like super hard. How do YouTubers do it? So I'm just gonna grab the angled part, the, t the top layer, top part. Okay, and then I'm gonna drag it a little bit down the nose. Like so. Are you seeing that? Are you seeing it? Yeah, okay. Then I'm gonna put it under here. It doesn't have to be perfect. You're gonna blend it. And then under here. I'm going to grab the side that I did with the concealer and I'm going to drag it down. Oh, I need to buy me a dictionary. It's brought in my words. Okay, so now I'm going to get the same side and then just tap. I'm not going to drag it, I'm just going to tap lightly. Okay, this is not tapping lightly. I'm literally punching my face. So we're going to punch our face really hard to keep that color there. Same way, Just tapping motions, like in circle, like you go up and down, up and down. Just keep it in that area, okay? Whatever is left in the brush, I'm just going to bring it up like so. Okay, now this girl needs more. Okay, so we're going to... Put it on there just a tiny bit and we're gonna uh, blend it out. I need the wet and wild translucent powder and I'm gonna use the sponge the flower beauty one and then I'm gonna place it and drag it here bring it up to my nose. See this gives it illusion of a slimmer nose and then around my smile lines because this girl talks a lot and she laughs a lot before i actually contour i like to put my fake right here sort of like a guide for my contour and also it'll help blend wait hold on It'll help blend my contour a little bit. Like if I pass the line, it'll diffuse it a little bit better. And I leave the part where the cream contour, I leave it untouched because I like to place the powder on top of it so it could stick better. Cover Effects Contour Palette. And this one has the powder. It's a face palette, I think, right? This is the Luxie Duo Fiber, Fiber, yeah, Fiber powder brush it's in the number 516 and I like using this to apply my contour in there we're just gonna dab a little bit of it tap it off and then I'm gonna place it and just let the tip of the brush do the work in circular motion get up here I just tap around it tapping motions I just get a little bit and then I just build it up and then grab some more and then when I go down here I just flip it up just flip it so when you go like that you're gonna have like a harsh line right here we want to do that we don't want to have that okay so what we want to do is hold on let me get this shit out of the way we just flip it up like this and then I want right here just go really hard on it go ham on it so you can have that jaw model which we can all have when it when it gets to the side of the face you're gonna see my hand goes retarded like it just doesn't know what it's doing i don't think i know what i'm doing either but why weren't you you guys wanted it this is the aesthetica p12 don't brush and now we're gonna blend this out like that See, whenever it just leaves that nice clean, and I just all over the face. Yeah, okay. 
So I'm gonna be using the Tarte, yeah, Park Avenue print this. And I'm gonna bronze my face with that one. I'm gonna use this one because I don't like to wash for this. This one comes in those, tap it off, and then I'm gonna bring it up on top of the contour to give us some color to know. And then we're gonna bring it across the forehead because we're gonna place this wherever we usually get sunburned, okay? Eyeshadow primer base. It's from Luscious Cosmetics and it's in the color Nude. I don't know if they have more colors, but I love it. I used to use concealers, but they were like a bit too tacky. So whenever I would, cause I, I like to use a lot of um, eyeshadow. Like I like to place a lot of eyeshadow on top of each other. It would become too tacky and the colors wouldn't stick anymore and blah, blah, blah. So I was like, you know what? I need to go back to using primers. And lucky me, I got this one in one of the boxy charms. I think it was this this month. I don't remember. And oh my god, I've been loving it. So we're gonna go in. I'm super excited to use this palette, dude. I, okay, so I'm gonna use a Morphe uh, M441, this mustardy yellow here, and I'm gonna apply this one on my crease. Whenever I get to the site, my hand just goes, what the fuck are we doing? I'm going to go in with Moki. I'm just going to use the same brush. I'm cleaning it off because I don't like to wash brushes, okay? So I'm going to place this, like, right inside the crease. OMG, I love this. Yeah, we're going to place this here. We're going to do, like, a halo eye. You know what? I'm going to take it all the way. Okay. So I'm going to take a little bit of Leo. This is a darker green and I'm going to place that right in the corner just to darken it up a bit. I'm going to take this Luxie brush, I think this is a Luxie brush, it's like an angled blending brush. So I'm going to get Laura Lee, Laura Lee, Laura Lee, Laura Lee. With fire OG and Moki, tapping both these two here, and then I'm gonna place it on the outer corner, the outer part of the eye, just to connect it here. Let's. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go in with gold, and I'm gonna put it with my finger. Oh my god, yes! That bringing it up to the brow bone color here and I'm gonna blend I'm gonna I'm going to blend these two shades together just to merge them merge somebody send me a dictionary yeah, this is my urban decay perversion one I can't see you guys, so just give me a minute. I close my eye and I see that it helps a little bit. Yes. And I like to go in with the sponge and just, since it's a little bit wet, just a little bit, it picks up and it really makes it stick in there. Oh, no, I know. Okay, this one right here. Peachy Cordy shade. Oh, I'm almost finished. I'm almost finished. My battery. I suck at this. I'm gonna buy me one of those. Um, I'm gonna place it under here, just the inner corner, but not like in the inner corner, like under. You know what I mean? Okay, I need to hurry because this thing is gonna turn off on me. You know, go buy me that adapter that doesn't need battery. Son of a bitch, I'm trying to hurry and I'm hurting my eyeballs. 
Oh, that looks very pretty. All right. Um, so I'm just gonna apply, some, apply my lipstick and mascara, and I'll be right back. So I just went ahead and placed, uh, put some mascara on. I used shit. Where is it? Where did it go? I used the Flower Beauty uh, Warrior Princess mascara. I applied some LMR blush. I did this off camera because I forgot. This is the the one that came in the boxy charm. I got the one in light, fair light, and I used Castaway here, and this one. I mixed them together and just to put it on there. And then I applied the Heart Candy Cashmere Silk in Biscotti, the Gigi Hadid, Gigi Hadid, Gigi. I'm just gonna say Gigi and Maybelline lip liner in Tara. And the Melt Cosmetics lipstick in Frisky. Where did I leave it? Yeah. If I use this one, it looks like that. This is the lip combo. I love this together. I used to use a lot of masks, but my lips are very dry. So I tried to put a little bit more hydrating stuff on there. So yeah. I guess that's it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. That's what I have to say, right? Just subscribe. Hit the subscribe button, okay? So you, and the post notifications, I don't know where it is. They just always point this way. Anyway, thanks for watching. I hope this was fun for you guys. Let me know on Instagram, anywhere, if you guys want something specific. If I can do it, okay? And I guess that's it.